Hi guys, welcome to another video on Hellgate London, the Steam version. My name is Wilfred. Today I'd like to play the game live uh, on one of the missions that could be rather interesting to watch. Uh, this In this video, I'm going to craft three power sources and to do that, I need to rip uh, any uh, glands from a demon carcass a little bit close, but I think it's just like, you know, whatever demon that I face, I just uh, kill them uh, and, uh, and and see what's going to happen. Now, um, I, I'm having some kind of blueprint and uh, you can see in the inventory here. Uh, these are some of the blueprint on uh, Xi'an power supply, prismatic power supply, as well as the uh, prismatic power supply again. So, you know, this, this require a little bit of uh, crafting, uh, green plus two blue, uh, one green, two blue, then you have the blue, red and green, then after that you need to have the uh, blue, red and green. Now, um, I need to go and, uh, you know, uh, exchange the gland uh, from one of the tech person in the L gate, um, which is over here. So what I'll do in this video, I'll just uh, fight my way through uh, Finn Church, Trinity Square, and then to Algate, and collect as much gland as possible, exchange for the uh, items, uh, so as to create a power uh, power sources. So uh, wish me luck. Um, it, it shouldn't be that hard. I've been doing it for a while, but you, you, you never know. I mean, sometimes this game does... Uh, does uh, shock you in some ways, uh, always a little bit of a strange thing going on. So I'm going to summon my demons and the, uh, let me just remember all, where, are my, all, where are all my buttons. Now I'm still playing the melee kind of like a range build. So I'm having two fire elementals, two force elementals, one storm for aerial target as well as one toxic. Uh, that's about it. I'm not going to do um, spectral. Let's see. So this is my AOE, I'm pouring quite a lot of things going on. So a lot of action going on here. I hope it's fun to watch. And uh, now I, I could, what I could do is to to summon my zombie. That, that was one option, don't have to do that right now. Probably if I see a single target worth killing, then I'll, I'll do that. Um, why? I don't know, just uh, okay. Now uh, I've got some some item I could do a uh, auto the uh, this uh, dismantler, so I'm gonna do that. All right. So I've got one hour buffer. There's a daily quest, free of charge. You can kind of like uh, in the past you need to pay for it. It's a gift. Uh, no, it's a cash shop item. But uh, this has been converted into a single single target game, a single player game. So there is no need for such um, such cash shop anymore. So I've got I've got uh, like enough number of zombies. All right. So these are all bees, I think. So I can I can switch back to to my human form because uh, I've got enough three zombies. Um, and uh, the good thing about human form is that I could do some kind of like AOE like this one, take down the uh, the mob that matter. Uh, and uh, oh, there's over there. You kind of know where they are after a while playing this game. Yeah, then uh, it becomes very fast, uh, fast paced so once you get a hang of things. Yeah, you know that it's going to be behind you. Okay, so I uh, still have th a few. Oh, there are some, some loots there. I can use an elemental explosion or whatever it is to to do like AOE. It's rather effective, it's a big area. Alright, so that's done. And uh, the reason why I'm kind of thought of is that I could um you know summon the messenger of hell to have better loot. It's one of the better thing about this version is that uh, there's this purpose in taking down even additional mobs like this. Alright, so that's done. So Trinity is over there. So it's just nice I managed to summon the messenger of hell. Maybe there's some good loot. Don't know. We'll see. Um, so far, am I getting any any good stuff? Um, 
let's see I probably don't need this one is for engineer marksman so I this uh, just this dismantle it I haven't really got any um demon yet to um, that all right all right aerial target so best is just to make to range Yep, don't have whole day. Fifty mobs to uh, to summon the the messenger of hell. Well, I'm finding the. Uh... Where's my heal? Where's my heal? Yep, my heal just came in. So it's kind of nice to have a healer. I know healer is not really a best DPS, but uh, it does keep me alive. Don't need to worry about things. He's a beast, by the way. Ah man, this is uh, the map is kind of crazy. You can't get through the other side. Okay, there's some. Uh, uh, okay. Yep. Oh, there's some Christmas stuff going on as well. I don't like the the Christmas flame, but I kind of like the nightmare. So I'm just going, going to have that. Look at my... I'm like on fire. I'm... the smoke is everywhere. Okay, then I can up my armor, go and... Uh, yep, I could do that. How does it work for melee on the on on a on a area target like this or flying target like this one? It's a little bit uh, tricky. It, it's working because I am summoning the I'm summoning the uh, the zombie. I don't know how effective it my uh, my my melee though to be honest. Okay, let's do a uh, AOE. Effective done. So my health is back up without using any health potion, or that's kind of like nice. Very nice, fast pace. I like it. Um, yeah, very, very nice. I I love it when when the, when the game runs really smooth. It's really a pleasure to to even play. Um, you know. It just like you just shoot everything down, as it meant to be. <laughs> the the only thing is that I need to find find a portal somewhere, otherwise this may take a while. Because none of this giving me the uh, the material for for the cost uh, for crafting the power source. All right, so let's see. I've been going in circle. Let's uh, let's go that way, shall we? Uh, this is also a dead end. Hmm. Okay, the uh, another option is on this side. What about this side? Okay, nope. How about this side? The, the only problem with the melee is that there is no sound to it, so I, uh, it's very hard for me to gauge like, what am I hitting. I think the sound would have been very, very useful. Um, yep, that's the one. Oh, 
Okay, so the uh, out gate is there. So I'm just heading over the out gate, which is the uh, out gates. Okay, so that is where I could um, get uh, farm material for my for my for my uh, quest here. So well, I've got something. Let's see what this one is. So there's a oh, that's nice. Mm, cost of six accuracy is something I could afford. In fact. So I could actually use it, um, this we say level 17 to 31. So uh, I can I can use it for both of them. Either one of them is fine. So I'm going to use it for this guy here, modded. Uh, then they give me the the, the critical damage. Uh, but it's against the spectral. So well, it's better than nothing. Uh, as of now, I have nothing. So, yep. Um, then I've got a few blueprint here and there. Horizon blueprint. This is something I can't use. This one I can't use. This one, I don't think I can use, so a uh, kind of junkish kind of thing, but um, eating up a lot of my space, to be honest. So now how it works is that uh, there is a temporary base here, and in this base, there are, you know, this is fortified, not that strongly, but I could ask Alex uh, to, to, oh, I could actually sell something here as well. Um, I could ask Alex to help me to um, craft something if I want to. And that is what uh, I need to do. The oh, nice. Um, <laughs> can can manage my inventory a little bit. I think we I need a stash around here. So the the uh, wow, you have the scroll. Okay, so these are these are the one. The okay, so so in case if you <laughs> lost it, you can buy it back, I guess. Um, and and create all this all this weird stuff. Okay, now let the fun begin. Uh, probably need to be a little bit thorough into clearing the area in order to uh, get the things that I need. So with that, then uh, I need to... I need to... <laughs> well, there's a lot of gland. Doesn't seem to be an issue. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> my my frame rate seems to be doing okay. I I press the panic button, which is basically the one that increased my my um my armor. Usually I do that before I I switch to like melee build. Alright, so that's done. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff. <laughs> is it even normal, seriously? What on earth? These are like a. Uh, I think I'm done. <laughs> By my goodness, uh, I don't think I've, I've worked for this one, but it kind of like. Okay, this is madness, man. Seriously, uh, this got to stop. I have, I have too many of this. <laughs> is there a limit to how many I get? <laughs> okay, wait, stop, guys. Uh, I think just stop, stop, stop. Due to my death. Okay, um, stop, 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 stop. Okay, wait. Now I could Ah <laughs> oh, goodness me so I need to I need to create a battery how in, how how in the world I create a battery I think I think there's enough uh, disgusting kind of gland in it so I need to go back to my trinity I I need to figure that one out on the um, this is getting super silly because I got so many items. Oh wow. Okay, back to my human form. Oh, I got stuck. <laughs> my
maggots are the best place to farm glands. Well, I think I'll be like having an inventory issue, isn't it? In very uh, short while. Good lord. Is that is that even normal? <laughs> oh man, my my finger is getting tired. <laughs> what kind of game is this? It won't fit. <laughs> oh man, goodness me! I I am not going to do this one. Hang on, uh, I need to go back to man. Where where is the? I think it's over that side. All right. Now. I it's just too many stuff. Um, it's crazy this game. So now I need to possibly well, create something like one of these scroll. Right. Um, what is that? Okay, so I got blue. I got bad blue, green, and red. I think. So well, let's do one thing at a time, right? Whoa! Hang on. Well, obviously, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, like, oh man, this is insane -ness. Okay, let, 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 let's see, let's, uh, let's calm down, man. I need to create a uh, green and a blue. One green and two blue. So, what I need to do is to... One green, one green and two blue. Okay, fine. Let's see. One green and two blue, one green and two blue. Let, let's do it one blue first. Alright. Okay. But uh, <laughs> I just need one. One green. And two blue. So you know what? I, I can destroy this one I suppose. <laughs> oh man, this is uh, insane. One green and two blue. Alright. One green and two blue. Two blue. Blue, blue, blue. Alright, so this is done. I can create this. So I... Oh, crap. It, uh... <laughs> it went in into nowhere because uh, there is no... A woman of discerning there. taste <laughs> there's, there's no inventory space uh my goodness it um i i think I, I think i can just throw away some of these guys first how, how, how am i going to throw this away let me just see let's delete this part all right fine uh, let, let, let's do it let's do it this okay um okay wait Let's just clear some space here. Okay, let's do it again. Uh, it it will require. I think I think this. Um, now the problem is that the quest items. I don't know where it has gone to. Um, I I I suspect it has uh, disappeared from my from my inventory somehow. But uh, in in any case, oh, that is bad news, isn't it? Um, Man, this is uh, this is craziness. So because I, I didn't have enough space, uh, there is no way for me to. Well, let's abandon this one. If I abandon this guy, I have to like redo everything again. I said, I suppose, that would be quite sad. Um. <laughs> oh oh oh! He can <laughs> he can Man, it it came back to my to my. <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, I mean, at, at least it doesn't disappear. Uh, I was a bit nervous because it's a very old game. I don't, I don't know who can support me. But uh, in, in view of my recent misfortune, let me just, for safety's sake, uh, delete some of this item first. <laughs> oh man, that was such a close call. Okay, fine. Uh, I, I think this one I need uh, one, one blue, one green, one red and one green, right? One blue, one red, one green. So I'll do it. So uh, let me just uh, create more space. Okay. Okay. Let me see this one. One blue. Oh, yeah. 
this guy here, this guy here. Oh my goodness. I'm, <laughs> I'm so terrible in crafting. Okay, let's do create. Okay, let's do create. Okay, and do this one. So I could go and create this one. So let me just move here. So there's my Okay, I've got two of this. Uh, the last one is going to be another... Man, this is like so scary. <laughs> Anything can happen. <laughs> okay, man, don't screw up. Uh, create. Okay, close. And create. Close. Create. <laughs> close. And create. All right, man. I I've, I've get it done, and I left with a lot of glands. Uh, yes. Please just take all this away from me. If it hadn't shown up, there's no way we could have gotten the portal back online. It's so easy. It's just go and loot all this gland lying around. Um, <laughs> okay, we need to tell uh, you know to prepare his evacuation. All right, that's cool. So now I I presume I don't need any of this thing, and uh, it it will take me a while to. Oh, does a vendor need all these things, basically? Do you, do you think he, he, he wanted to be... Let Hello. me see. Whether... I help you? No, no. He doesn't want any of this. So I have to click through this guy um, to, to, to get it uh, all sorted. You know what? I, 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 would, I, I would not do it in this video. I, would, I promise I won't do it. Okay, last rule, last rule. So, um, let's see. Evacuation. So we need to go back to uh, return return to Lord of Found. <laughs> oh man, I don't believe it. Ah, oh, goodness me. So I need to. Okay, there was a there was no space uh, to summon the portal. That's why it didn't appear. So now it does. All right. Okay. Now it's evacuation. Now, but before we do that, I would like to. Before we do that, I would like to just clear my inventory first, because it's just too, too much chunks there. So, <laughs> things that I could uh, clear off, I clear off first. Mm. Oh wow! All right, that's good. The rest of it, I just like. Oh man, this is super painful. Another two row of crap. Um. So that's done, and uh, I have to talk to this guy here for the evacuation. Let's see. Okay, so... The portal at out gay, the power by my by my stuff, is working properly, and uh, Manuman has been badly damaged. Teleportation is not viable, I need to come up with yet another evacuation plan. Remember Give you some time to think, okay. That was fast. Raymond has lost contact with the artifact. We fear Maxim might have taken it to into the Hellgate. It's lost for good. May Maxim so burn for this. Now we must focus on the life we can we can save. Teleportation is too great a risk due to the vol volatility of monument stations damage teleport gateway. We are going to have to travel the old fashioned way. There are subway cars in Cannon Street, but the tax myth need help getting them operational. Go and help in any way you can, and I'll consult with uh, Raymond regarding the lost virtue. Bye, my friend. So, well, then, you know, then it goes on into yet another whole oh, series of boy. like um, the, you know, well, I mean, like whatever it is. Um, yeah, after a while you don't really read it, but uh, you have to go to Bye. catacombs. So now, well, the story is that there is some evacuation required Victims now, um, and you just don't My really matter anymore. <laughs> My sunshine return. Okay, people are not happy with Maxim, so I think uh, we'll, we'll head to Liverpool and meet Jessica soon, which is of course the granddaughter of the uh, the great hero, can't remember his name. Um, in terms of quest-wise, I need to go to King's uh, William Catacomb and so on and so forth. So the uh, so these are the new areas being opened, um, to, and there's a Ken Cannon Street as well. So I... Uh, well, I mean, I don't want to make a video too long, so this is going to be excitement for another day. Um, I don't really have any good loot today, though. That is a little bit... Uh, ooh! All my stuff is magically disappeared. 
I didn't even need to do that, to be honest. What a waste of my time. So yeah, uh, upon the note for my future self is that if you are, if you get too much of the gland and whatnot, don't worry about it. It will disappear when you turn in. Uh, somehow the glands just vaporize into the hell dimension, shall I say? All right. Um, okay, till next time we see each other. Goodbye. And uh, I'm liking my summoner a lot. Uh, it's really fun. Still like um, level 28. So I'm very looking forward to becoming more awesome maybe level uh, 30 then i open up a uh, new option in terms of the uh, what i can do with the um with the necromancy uh, necromancy car build on on perhaps uh, i think this one required 35 to sacrifice a zombie to do a devastating uh, strike um, but the problem with this game is that it doesn't tell you how devastating it is, just say that it's devastating, so how will I know if it is really good? But I, I kind of like the swarm a lot, so it is, it is definitely something that I would like to invest more into it, uh, because I need the poison and the duration as well as the attack strength. The uh, Then the radius is being increased as well, so this is a really good thing to have uh, when there are some AoE scenario, which I kind of face a lot of time. Uh, the spawning of the zombie is... Um, is I, I'm still trying to figure out uh, is, it, is it is it really something I want to do or I will go back to the um, good old fashioned I just want to explore this one perhaps maybe I don't do the uh, the melee form um, so but I su suppose this guy is pretty good at the um, you know single target and also the you know with this guy here the you know sorry with this guy here there's a kind of like a venom armor that um, that creating armor with deadly poison and then that that is uh, that's kind of good because it give me the armor increase uh, seems a little bit more durable so I don't know I'm still experimenting the build and as and when I've got something exciting I'll kind of let you uh, know what happened to my my, my new my new build uh, all right so uh, all right till the next time we see each other goodbye and enjoy uh, whatever you're doing and if you're playing Hellgate London as well do drop me a note um, you know, share with me your progress perhaps uh, I know we can't play together in this version and I I'm hoping that uh, my US version of the Hellgate London will arrive I've got Southeast Asia version but unable to uh, patch it with the revival patch as well as the uh, what's the other one um, the the London 2038 uh, which is a fan base kind of like a uh, multiplayer version so I can't do that right now but once my um, once my US version of the Hellgate London arrive, I may be able to do something more for you guys. Alright, see you next time. Goodbye.